When it's just you, well, times can be tough. When there's no one there to catch. Dear Diary, every now and again, you just need your space to be cleaned out. Most people would say it's spring cleaning fever, but at my house, it's about once every three months. I have never been accused of being a particularly tidy person, but at the same time, I am not super messy either. Well, as far as I'm concerned, I'm not. Sunday, Cameron was bored and wanted to clean up the workbench area so we could set up for reloading pew pews. So he pulled everything out of the corner well, almost everything, and started stacking it on the new aquarium stand. He is finally coming over today to put that stuff away so we can continue the tank build tomorrow. It turns out Google pays me on the 21st. I went back through my checking account and it's almost always on the 21st. So, for sure tomorrow I should be getting lumber for the tank build. Right now, however, I need to get some of these tanks topped back off so they don't make so much noise. You can really hear it sometimes when I'm doing the voiceover, and I would prefer it wasn't so loud. As I stated yesterday, I needed to fill up the 90 gallon sump. I always fill sump filtered tanks from the sump. That way you know how much room you have before it overflows. Next, the 56 gallon Severum grow out tank gets the top off. These little guys sure are growing a lot faster now that they can eat the bigger foods. Their parents tank needed some assistance as well. I figured I would suck up as much of the BGA as I could just so I wouldn't have to treat the tank for as long. While I top off the 40 breeder with the seven Severum babies in it, I will try and clean most of the duckweed out of Old Red's tank so some more light can get down to red. I usually try and do it once every couple months because the duckweed gets out of control otherwise. Holy fish poop, Batman. Red has made quite a mess in here. The joys of a large fish keeper. Bigger fish is usually bigger poop. Well, let's get that out of here too. Okay, so I think that will wrap up today's entry into my diary of a fish keeper. Please be sure to share, like, and subscribe. And just remember, guys and gals, we're feeding the addiction one tank at a time through education and inspiration. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye now.